Hi guys, my name is Matt. And in this video, I'd like to share with you what I think is the best leveling pet that a Beast Mastery Hunter can have from level 65 all the way to 120. Now, the reason you need to be level 65 is because for Beast Mastery, that is the level that you can unlock the ability to tame exotic beast. Once you're level 65, you can get upgrades to regular pets. So, for instance, in my stable here, I have the wolf that I started off with. This wolf is a ferocity pet that is going to do um, a little bit of self-healing and also offer a bloodlust um, in instances. So you can then upgrade to a cleft hoof, which is what I think the absolute best pet is. And where you want to go to get your first cleft hoof is down here around Ushagun in the Grand in Outland. So you'll see that there's a lot of cleft hoofs that are just kind of patrolling out here in these big packs. And um, whichever skin you like, you can get this one. You can get a more red one up at Ring of Blood if you like. Um, and this one will do the stuff that a regular ferocity pet does, which is a little bit of self-healing for you and the pet. Um, but it will also do some unique things that I want to share with you guys. So here I'm taming Banthar, which is a quest mob. Okay, he's tamed, no problem. And now let me show you what Banthar can do. So again, we're going to say that he gives self-healing 10% of leech. And he also is going to come with primal rage, which is heroism or ferocity, depending on which faction you are. But more importantly, the cleft hoof is also going to have a couple small bonuses that add up to really big things for you as a hunter. The first one is Blood of the Rhino. The Cleft Hoof has 10% additional armor, so 10% more than all the other pets, and increases the effectiveness of healing by 20%. That's the big thing, is that it gets 20% more heals from men pet. And I'll tell you from being out questing and pulling large packs that that feels like much more than 20% because of the difference, guys. The other thing that Cleft Hoof also have, which is a small bonus, is they have thick hide. So whenever they get below 40%, the cleft hoof skin will thicken, granting them 60% reduced damage for 15 seconds. So this happens automatically. So that's a bonus that turtles and some other pets have, but the combination of the fact that you already get some self-healing with the leech, you have a bloodlust for hard enemies, and you get 10% more armor and 20% more healing with the cleft hoof, in my opinion, makes them the best leveling and soloing pet in the game. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Go out and get your very own cleft hoof, and I will see you guys in the next one.